I'm glad I don't have to hunt my own food because I don't even know where sandwiches live. What's up everybody? Welcome back to the Dan Nader channel. In today's video, we're gonna be comparing the Cherry Bomb Glass Pack with the Cherry Bomb Salute. Cherry Bomb offers a variety of performance mufflers for the budget conscious consumer. And these two mufflers offer a lot of bang for their buck. First, let's take a look at the construction of both of these mufflers, starting with the glass pack. So the glass pack is a straight through design. It has a perforated inner pipe wrapped in fiberglass packing, and then has this outer shell that is 100% welded construction. This glass pack is a reversible design, so it doesn't matter which way you put it on, obviously, because it's a straight pipe. There's very little restriction, so it really it maximizes the horsepower of your vehicle. So the glass pack has a very small, compact, round design. They do come in a variety of lengths. There's one with an eight inch body. This is a, I believe a 24 inch body, 30 inch overall length. So this simple, compact design allows you to be able to install this muffler in tight spots and makes for pretty easy installation. All right, next, let's look at the Salute. Now the Salute has a more of a traditional shape and body of a muffler. However, this actually is a straight through design. The Salute has one single perforated pipe that goes through the body of this muffler. That inner perforated pipe is wrapped in steel wool and what they call roving fibers. Roving. Which I can only assume to be fiberglass. Not entirely sure. The Salute does have a higher grade 409 stainless steel body for its construction. It's 100% welded. It too is a reversible design because of that single straight through pipe. So again, the Salute does have a standard body size for the muffler. So you may not be able to get as creative as you could with the glass pack in installing this on your vehicle. Well, that's the construction of these two mufflers. Let's see how they compare in their performance. Let's first look at the loudness of these mufflers, starting with the glass pack. According to their website, the glass pack registers at 85 decibels at 2000 RPM, which they consider that a level four. Now the data for the Salute isn't listed on their website, so I can only guess as to what the sound output would be on the Salute by comparing it to similar mufflers. If you look at the Vortex on their website, it's listed at 87 decibels at 2000 RPM, and it's a level six. So again, I can only guess the Salute is probably somewhere between the glass pack and the Vortex between 80 and 87 decibels at 2000 RPM, and giving it a level of somewhere between three to five. So let's take a look at airflow rates. According to Cherry Bomb's website, the glass pack flows air at 510 CFM. Again, the performance data is not listed on Cherry Bomb's website for the Salute, so I'm going to compare it between the glass pack and the Vortex once again. The Vortex is listed at 578 CFM, so I'm going to put the Salute somewhere between 510 and 580. All right, so now, what kind of damage are we talking for your wallet? The glass pack is a very inexpensive muffler. You can get them as short as like 12 inch overall length up to 30 inch overall length. So the price of the glass pack starts as low as about $20. And of course, whatever length you choose, the price will be a little bit different. Now the Salute with its standard body starts at anywhere from $33 to $35, depending on where you find them. And interesting enough, the Salute also comes in a four inch round body. But for the testing purpose today, I just have the standard body design. Well, that's enough of me yapping about these mufflers. You wanna hear how they sound. Enjoy the video.
it. That's the comparison between the glass pack and the Salute. Which one did you like better? Let me know in the comments below. Personally, I really like the sound of the glass pack on my pickup truck. It has that nice hot rod, rumble sound. It's a little bit louder than the Salute. I will note that the glass pack has been used on my truck for several thousand miles, and that fiberglass packing may have burned out, because I do notice that the glass pack is louder now than from when I first put it on the truck. Having said that, I would suspect that the Salute may get a little bit louder over time. I don't know how much steel wool would, would burn out on these. I wouldn't suspect that they would burn out very much at all, so the sound may not be affected over time. Don't get me wrong, I really do like the sound of the Salute. It does have a very refined growl. but I do like the aggressive tone that comes out of the glass pack. So for me, I'm gonna go with the glass pack on this. I would also like to note that the interior drone noise was less significant with the Salute than it was the glass pack. So again, Cherry Bomb offers a lot of bang for their buck. You get a good high quality construction out of the Salute for about $30 to $35 for their standard size muffler. And with the glass pack, you get that classic loud rumble, crackle and pop, hot rod sound. So whichever muffler you choose, you're gonna get a great sound for the money. Well, that's gonna do it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, or appreciated the work that went into it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Again, leave a comment below which muffler did you like best. If you'd like to see more comparisons with Cherry Bomb mufflers, check out my Cherry Bomb mufflers playlist. I've purchased all the mufflers that Cherry Bomb offers, and I've put them on my Silverado. I used to have a Yukon, and I put a couple on my Camaro. And if you're so inclined, check out the rest of my channel. I've got all kinds of repairs, some vlogs, some fun projects that I'm working on. And if that so happens to earn your subscription, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. I'd greatly appreciate it. And if you'd like to help a guy out and help him grow his channel, check out the merch link in the description below, or else click on one of the thumbnails in the store below the video. The merch I have listed in the store is already dirt cheap, but if you use code DAMTAN at checkout, you can save 10% on your order. Again, any purchase you make there is greatly appreciated and helps the channel grow. And be sure to stay tuned to the Dan Ender channel. We're going to have more muffler videos to come, and I've got some great projects I'm working on. So as always, thanks for watching. God bless. We'll see you next time.